<laughs> Ronaldo? Ronaldo? What's happening? Naeli, what are you doing here? Oh, the girlfriend arrives. How unexpected. It's good to see you here, Naeli. I came to surprise you, but it seems I'm the one surprised. I thought you were working late. But is this what you're doing? Cheating on me? With her? It's not... It's not what it looks like, Naeli. <laughs> Actually, it's exactly what it looks like. We were planning our future. How could you? Things change, Naeli. People change. I... We... Moved on. Moved on to bigger and better things, darling. You know, fame, fortune, and all that. You shut up! Why, Ronaldo? But I loved you! We promised each other! Promises are just words, Naomi. They mean nothing if you can't back them up with action. Sweetie, he needs someone who can keep up with his world. You're just... not that person. So all those years... Was that all just nothing? It was something. Once. That's over. Shauna's right. You just don't fit in my life anymore. Time to move on, sweetheart. Ronaldo already has. Now, Shu, he's going to be famous now. Just like me. I hope she's worth that, Ronaldo. I really do. Nelly, you've been really quiet today. Everything okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Just a little tired, that's all. It's not like you to be this down. If something's wrong, you know you can talk to me, right? Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our show, where we're here with Shauna and Ronaldo, who've recently gone public with the relationship. Tell us, how long has this beautiful romance been brewing? Well, we've been seeing each other for a few months now. It's been an amazing journey, getting to know each other on a deeper level. He's such an amazing guy. The most perfect guy a girl can have. <laughs> <laughs> so is she. It's like we're meant for each other. Nelly, isn't that your boyfriend, Ronaldo? I... I had no idea. I'm so sorry. I just found out yesterday to see them together. Admitting it to the world? It's like I meant nothing. Nayeli, that guy doesn't deserve you. You are worth so much more than how he treated you. I loved him, Claire. I really did. And all this time he was with her. It's all over the internet. Everyone knows but me. I feel so stupid. You're not stupid, Nayeli. You loved and you trusted. He's the one at fault, not you. I can't stay here. I need to take the rest of the day off and clear my mind. Do you want company? I can come with you. We can talk or not talk. Whatever you need. Thanks, Claire. I need some time alone right now, but I appreciate it, really. Anytime, Naeli. And remember, this pain won't last forever. You'll get through this stronger than ever. What do you think you're doing? Just capturing the moment. You're quite the sensation online, you know? Ronaldo's biggest loser. How dare you! Get out of here now! This is my house! Oh, come on. Don't be like that. The world wants to see the girl who lost Ronaldo to Sean. Smile! Stop it! I'm not a part of your sick game! <laughs> Go on, Nayeli. Give us a grin. Show us what Ronaldo's missing out on. You're pathetic! Leave me alone! Is this what my life is now? Harassed because... Because of love? Nayeli! What the hell is going on? There are photographers outside trying to jump our fence. Devin, I... I didn't want any of this, I swear! Did you see them? They're everywhere! My boss just called me now. He said pictures of me in my pajamas are online. This is insane. What the heck is going on? I know, I know, and I'm sorry. This thing with Ronaldo has blown up more than I could have ever imagined. Sorry doesn't cut it, Nayeli. Our home is supposed to be a safe space. 
not a circus for the whole world to gawk at. Devin, please, I don't know what to do. I didn't ask for any of this. I didn't ask Ronaldo to... to betray me like this, or for it to become some spectacle. Well, you need to figure something out. I can't live like this, Nielly. My privacy, my life, is being turned upside down because of of whatever this is. I'm trying to deal with it as best as I can. I didn't think... I didn't think it would affect you like this. I'm so sorry. <sighs> whatever. I'm so done with this. <gasps> Nayeli, what the hell are you doing here? Ronaldo? I I'm just grocery shopping. What are you doing? Don't play dumb with me. Are you following me now? Is that what you become? A stalker? Oh, this is rich. The jilted lover can't get enough of her ex, huh? No, I, I didn't even know he'd be here. I'm not following anyone. Sure, sure. Can't even do a simple grocery run without you haunting me. What do you want from me, Naeli? I don't want anything from you, Ronaldo. I just wanted some peace. Man, you must feel so threatened. Is she giving you a hard time? It's been unbearable. She won't leave me alone. Following me? Sending me messages? That's not true! I haven't done anything! Did you get all that? Every single moment. And with a little bit of editing, the story will be sensational. Ronaldo, for the record. How have you been coping with all this attention from Nayeli? It's been tough, you know. I try to move on, but she's everywhere. I've even received threats. I just want to live my life in peace. That sounds really hard, Ronaldo. We'll make sure the public knows what you're going through. And it's been really hard, you know. What's going on? Why are you watching this? Just watch. Ronaldo's on TV playing the victim. I never wanted any of this to happen. Nelly, she just... she just took things too far. I can't even have my privacy anymore. She's been even sending me death threats too. Lies. All lies. This looks bad, Nelly. Really bad. But you know the truth, right? I didn't do any of the things he's accusing me of. <sighs> I don't know what to believe anymore. This... This whole situation is out of control. But I need you to believe me. I thought you, of all people, would have my back. I did have your back, Nielly. But this, it's too much. It's all over the news, and now it's affecting me too. I can't deal with this drama anymore. Devin, please, don't do this. If you leave, I, I can't afford to stay here on my own. And what about what I can afford? Huh? My privacy has been invaded. My life turned upside down. I didn't sign up for this when I agreed to be your roommate. So what? You're just going to leave me to deal with this mess all by myself? I have to think of my own well-being, Nayeli. I'm sorry, but I can't do this anymore. I'm moving out. Devin, wait. We can figure this out, please. I can't, Nayeli. This... it's too much. I hope you find a way to clear your name, but I can't be a part of this anymore. Nayeli, what are you doing here? Is everything okay? No, everything's not okay. Can I come in? Of course. Where's mom and dad? They're outside at work. You look like you've been crying. What happened? <sighs> it's just everything's falling apart. I don't know what to do. Talk to me, Nay. I'm here for you, no matter what. I feel like I'm losing myself. I don't know who I am anymore, but it feels like I've hit rock bottom. I'm scared, Marsha. Starting over is terrifying. Oh, Nayeli, I'm so sorry. You are so much more than that, Nayeli. You're strong, kind, and brilliant. This... this is just a setback. Then there's only one way to go, right? Up. You're not alone, Nay. You have us, your family. We'll help you through this. Thank you, Marsha. I don't know what I'd do without you. It's okay to be scared, but you won't be starting over alone. You'll never have to find out. We're family and we stick together, through thick and thin. I think I'm going to need help. And you'll have it. We'll make a plan, figure out the next steps. 
You're going to come back from this stronger than ever. You'll see. All right, whenever you're ready, impress me. <clears throat> okay, here I go. When you, I mean, I, uh, when we, um... Again! Th the thing about love is... That was trash! Do it again! Love, love is like a, like a big pizza pie. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? That's amore, not a line from our play. What's next? A commentary on moon hits in your eye? I'm so sorry, I just... Robert, my love for you is like a big... <laughs> oh my god! Please! Make it stop! <laughs> I guess I'm not what you're looking for. My dear, what I'm looking for is talent. But you certainly brightened my day. Thank you for the, uh, performance? I'm sorry for wasting your time. <laughs> no, no. Thank you. I needed a good laugh. Don't call us. We'll call you. <laughs> All right. Let's hear what you got. We can't be friends, but I'd like to just pretend. <laughs> Is this a joke? Are you trying to slam in the cat? <laughs> I, I know, sir. I thought... You thought? You thought, honey, thinking and doing are worlds apart in your case. I, I can do better. Please, just give me another chance. I've heard enough. This is a music studio, not a comedy club. You may leave now. No, sir, please, give me another chance. Seriously, though, don't quit your day job. Whatever it is, it can't be worse than this. I don't understand. I thought I had something to share. What you have to share isn't music. Maybe try, I don't know, gardening. Slush noise! <laughs> Maybe they're right. Maybe I'm just fooling myself. I can't do this anymore. It's over. Well, well, if it isn't Nayeli, the aspiring star. Heard you've been trying to make it in acting and singing. How's that going for you? Shauna, please, not now. Just leave me alone. <laughs> oh, come on. You can tell me. I've seen those auditions of yours. What a performance, really. I was moved to tears of laughter. <laughs> Shauna, just leave me alone. Let me just do my own thing, okay? Oh, what's the matter, huh? Can't take a little feedback. I thought you'd be used to rejection by now. Seriously, Nayeli, why bother? Everyone knows you're just... wasting your time. You don't know anything about me. Oh, I know enough. I know that no matter how hard you try, you'll never be good enough. Why don't you just give up and leave me and my boyfriend alone? <laughs> Running away? That's what you're best at, isn't it, Nayeli? <laughs> <laughs> Is there anything I'm good at? Wait, I forgot I still have those pictures. <laughs> what a day it was when I was awarded the first prize for having the most knowledge about medical. It was a part of me. Wait, hold on a minute. Who said that I have to be famous to take revenge? I'll be a successful doctor, and it's something that I'm really good at as well. Yes! This is my chance! <sighs> okay, Nayeli, now's your chance. Um, excuse me, I want to meet Dr. Paul. He asked me for an interview. Nayeli? Oh my god. Is this for real? He seems too beautiful to be a doctor. <clears throat> get your act together, Nayeli. You're here to get a job. Oh, hi, Dr. Paul. It's me, Nayeli. You called me yesterday? Yes, I did. Please follow me. Oh gosh. How can someone be so beautiful? Let's start with a basic scenario. A patient comes in complaining of chest pain. 
What steps would you take to assess their condition? Um, well, I think I would, uh, ask the patient about their symptoms and, uh, take their vital signs and then maybe, uh, order some tests like an EKG or blood work? Good, good. Now, let's delve a bit deeper. If the patient's EKG showed signs of a heart attack, what immediate steps would you take to stabilize them? If the EKG showed signs of a heart attack, I would immediately administer aspirin to thin their blood and reduce the risk of clotting. Then I would start them on an oxygen therapy to improve their oxygen levels and monitor their vital signs closely. Depending on the severity of the situation, I might also consider administering medication to help alleviate their symptoms. Very good, Nayeli. You seem to have a solid understanding of emergency procedures. I have to say, I'm very impressed with your performance today. You've shown a strong grasp of medical knowledge and excellent problem-solving skills. Thank you so much, Dr. Paul. I've worked really hard to get to this point. Welcome aboard, Nayeli. I have no doubt that you'll be a valuable asset to our hospital. You can join from tomorrow. Thank you so much, Doctor. You have no idea how much this means to me. Nayeli, we need to get to the ER. There has been an accident, and they need all hands on deck. Right behind you, Dr. Paul. Dr. Nayeli, we need you in room 3. The patient's condition is deteriorating. Nayeli, you were incredible in there. Your quick thinking and steady hands saved lives today. It was a team effort, Dr. Paul. We couldn't have done it without everyone's hard work. Nayeli, you were incredible in there. Your quick thinking and steady hands saved lives today. Thank you, everyone. I'm honored to be a part of this team, and I promise to continue giving my all to our patients. Looks like you're becoming a bit of a celebrity around here, Nayeli. I never expected this, Dr. Paul. But if it means I can inspire others to strive for excellence, then I'm grateful for the opportunity. Babe, I'm home. Babe? <laughs> oh, come on now, Mark. Stop it now. Gosh, you're so funny. <laughs> well, I certainly love to make me love smile. Aw, oh, Mark, you're so romantic. <laughs> Shauna? What is going on here? Are you cheating on me? Oh, look who's here. I guess you found out. But I don't understand. I thought you loved me. Loved you? <laughs> you have to be kidding me. Have you seen yourself in the mirror? You're nothing in front of my beauty. And look at Mark. He's tall, handsome, muscular, and everything that a guy can serve me. Well, then if you didn't like me, then why were you even with me for all this long? What was all that for? Ronaldo, dear, I'm a star. I'm meant to be in the spotlight. And besides, my music was getting old, and people wanted some great taste in my lyrics. So being with you just helped me get better. I don't believe it! I never thought you'd stoop this low. You know what? Naeli was right about you. You're nothing but a snake, you witch! Keep your tongue in check, Ronaldo! Don't forget you're crossing your limits now. You can get yourself in trouble. Leave. Now. Where am I supposed to go now then, huh? I was completely dependent on you. You just ruined everything for me. <laughs> well, either you can leave without causing any drama, or I'll have to call my guards on you. I was so wrong when I decided to date you. I hope your life gets ruined as well, Shauna. Goodbye. <laughs> Who do you think can ruin my life, huh? <laughs> <laughs> hey! Wait up! Huh? Uh oh. I want to see Nayeli. Is she there? Dr. Nayeli just left for home. You can come in tomorrow. No, please. Can you give me her address? Sir, we're not allowed to do that. Please. You have to come in tomorrow. Please. Just please. It's really important. I really need to talk to her. She knows me. I'm her... friend. Please. Mm, sure. Come inside. Whoa, is this for real? Does she live here all by herself? <laughs> you can't catch me, Mommy. Oh, I will! Come back!
back to mommy, Lila. <laughs> no! Huh? Ronaldo? Um, Lila, sweetheart, can you go inside? Mommy will come play with you soon. Okay, Mommy. What are you doing here? Is she your daughter? Yes, I'm married now. Oh, I see. I guess I don't stand any chance anymore. What do you mean? I just wanted to apologize for everything. I realize my mistake now. I shouldn't have cheated on you. But I don't understand. I thought you were with this famous pop star. What's her name? Shauna Jackson? She cheated on me, all right? I saw her having a great time with another right in front of my eyes. Hmm. Well deserved, I guess. You may leave now. No, wait. Nearly, please. I have nowhere to go. I was completely dependent on Shauna, and now I've lost everything. My house, my savings, and my job. Please, can I at least get to work for you? I'll do anything. Ronaldo, let go of me! Who's that you're talking to, darling? How can I help you, sir? Um, honey, it's, um, a guy that I decided to hire as our cook. I know how badly we wanted one, so there, we have one. Oh, that's great news then. Come on in, buddy. I'll guide you. I... I can't believe it. You still remember the stuff that I'm really good at. Of course. Because you may not have loved me truly, but I did. You can start working here now. Thank you so much. I'll never be able to forget this. 